Lobby. Level. Good morning. Today we're on Black Home Mountain. I don't think we're going to go for one as tough as yesterday because we're still feeling pretty wrecked. <laughs> yeah. But we're going to get up there, have a look around, explore a bit. Just take it easy. Maybe a picnic by the lake or something. It's just so beautiful up there, we just have to do it. She's still struggling from yesterday. The weather today is not as nice either, which is annoying. See, it's pretty cloudy up there, but we'll make the most of it. Yeah, these are amazing. They're yeah. so good. Is that one of the few tech ones? It's a DJI Allspark. Oh, I see. Yeah. They're really sick for like boarding and stuff. So, no. No GoPro? I like this already. It's like much more quieter than Whistler. Yeah. Oh, that sun. Feels so good. It's too hot. I hope it stays all day. I'm already boiling. home now not at the top we're still quite far away from the top but it's cold it's, cold. it's really really cold i got my toque Thea's, Thea's rugged up already i think i might go gloves or something and that weather's just coming in hard it's just lots and lots of cloud one thing this place is really good at is telling you all the things you can't see for example they got a really good guide of all the different mountains <clears throat> that are visible from Not here. We're on the trail, and the first thing we get is a string. More snow. Fun times. But today we got something that we didn't have yesterday hiking poles! Uh, they were very kind enough to lend us some at the bottom of the start, start of the trail. So today we're gonna be really, really prepared. I know I said we we're just gonna go for like a little stroll, but next thing you know, we have hiking poles. We've, we're going on a big loop. And Thea's decided just to destroy some of the mountain while she can. Landslide. <laughs> you happy now? Was that your little avalanche for the day? I was. <laughs> Can't take her anywhere. She just wrecks everything. So I've got a time lapse set up on my GoPro there, which is actually hooked up to an IKEA egg timer. And we're just gonna get a really nice 10 minute time lapse coming around, seeing all of Whistler. picnic lunch set up in the perfect location and then we have the perfect picnic lunch as well got cheese salami ch uh, cherries crab passe and some bagels we nicked from breakfast I'm pretty happy I'm also happy is that what you're waiting for me to say <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
Now, it's the middle of summer, and we're going to do something that you normally can't do in the middle of summer. Thea, I challenge you to a snowball fight. I call that a draw. <laughs> Lunch time over. The air's getting warm. It's cold and windy up here. Yeah, it's getting a bit cold and windy. But oh, the photos here are amazing. Check out these. That was a nice hike. Back at the main sort of black home gondola point. It's a bit crowded here. So plan for now is we're gonna go and take the peak to peak gondola that goes between Black Home Mountain and Whistler Mountain. I promise some pretty good views on that one. That next cable point is the last one for like what looks like a couple kilometers. A bit worrying? <laughs> nah, it looks gorgeous up here already. It's actually three kilometers of Yeah, that is not a rope. So that's the one that they use to pull. And that's the one that holds all the weight. We're on the gondola back down to the town. And we're gonna hit the hot tub when we get back. How hard are we gonna hit the hot tub? Pretty hard. It's pretty cold up there. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty cold. Especially when you sit around waiting for Luke to take photos all, all the time. It gets cold. It is 8 p.m. Is it 8 p.m. or is it like 8.30? It's 8 p.m. It's, it's 8 p.m. and I'm sitting here going, I should have brought my sunnies. How is it still so bright? It's also the nicest weather yet we've had. It's seriously annoying when the weather is beautiful when you're down at the bottom, but when you get to the top, it just gets super cloudy. And the lifts are closed. <laughs> you know, we could have got the last lift up and then just walked back down. Yeah, but dinner. She makes good points. <laughs> There's dinner. This cocktail jug is the size of my head or bigger. It's a strawberry and mango co a sake cocktail jug. He called it a spango, so then he had to put a P on there as an edamame P. <laughs> it's a spango with a P. 